What's up guys, so I got a few suggestions to actually go back and see the actual Kenny, Kenny ending, okay, Kenny ending, so I made a separate slot to go see that and see how it actually is now. Of course, we're going to let, look away when the choice happens and we're going to go ahead and see what happens then. I heard that it's better than Jane's ending, we'll see how it actually is, I'm pretty excited to see what it is because people are pretty confident that it is better, so I can't wait. Let's see how it is. I heard it's better. I'm not really sure how it's better, but we'll see. Because, you know, obviously Jane ends up in the hole's hardware. Kill a fucking giant? I didn't right. kill him! Fight. It was an accident, Kenny! You sure? She I was like so confident lying. So confident lying. I'm warning you. We can't kill each other. Not after all this. We're all that's left. <laughs> Only us three. Clem, stay back. I was just confused at this moment. I was like, is she telling the truth or is she lying? Did she kill a baby or did she not? I don't know. But she does have a copy of Walter's knife there. Get the fuck off! Fuck you! She was pretty confident about fighting him. Please don't. Jesus. Let's pull it on this time. He's like, what? They got Jane, like Jane took it too, like, too serious. Like she lied and then oh God, like now that I know she lied, I don't know. I ain't going nowhere. I'm getting between them and see what happens. Stop it guys, we're both awesome here. We don't got to This is on you! This is both of y'all. Run! Not Please. Stop it! She really just threw Clementine. She ain't. Fucking kill you. How is she? She's gonna lie to him, get in a fight with him for no reason, and then take it all seriously. Jane, what you're doing? Oh my god. Like, seeing this after she lied was just. I don't know. Jesus, man. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and pick up the gun and look away. Jesus, Clem, you got this. Man, I can't believe she lied. Okay. Like, what I really should have done is not forgave Jane and went on my own. Well, I should have did. But people were still mad about that too, because you know I would have killed Kenny. The knife is right in her chest. I saw that blood. Shouldn't have lied, Jane. Shouldn't have lied. Now I know your secret. Look away. I wonder if you can hear the actual cut through her chest. Ah! Okay. That was... That was something. It's over and now he's like, oh my god, AJ. Jane is dead, knife right through the chest, and Kenny is an emotional Kenny. wreck again. AJ, he's gone, Clem. I wonder if his reaction when the baby she, cries. She just... Or when we go up to the baby. How could she do that? Oh, Jesus. She didn't have to lie about... He's she could shoot Kenny. He had to kill... What? He's, are you okay? You can shoot Kenny. I'll live. So that might, might be uh, probably the third ending. You're alone with the baby. I might do a reaction to that next. If you guys Go. want me to. I'm right Kenny's like, you. oh my god, the baby crying. <laughs> you, can't, you can't believe it. Stupid plan, stupid plan, stupid plan. Oh my god, AJ! Oh my god. Oh. Jeez. Are you okay? He's alive. What's she gonna say, Kenny? 
Let me see him. He's so happy. Oh, uh, look at him. He is so happy right now. I thought people were right. Like if you, you kill, let him kill Jane. He will get I back to his old self. I thought Jane killed him. Back to his Jane old happy self. Him. I was thinking the same thing, Clem. That's why I was so fired up. She never wanted the baby around. She made that clear. Yeah, hey, I, like I guess, but she? I just maybe. Why would she? I don't know. She was nuts, Clem. Nuts. A disturbed person that had her own agenda and was looking out for herself. She's looking out for me. Okay, never mind. Right, Shouldn't say anything. Okay, so happy hey, now. Listen, I, I, I didn't want that to happen either. I thought she killed Alvy Clem, and at any point she could have stopped what was happening by saying he was fine. True. She wanted. That's how. I never, I, why the cow ever body? hurt you? You understand? I was protecting you. Believe it. You believe me, right? Yeah. Just imagining what she did to Alvy. Everything just went black. Hearing Kenny's side makes it all like. I don't know. It was too late. What you hear Jane's side of the story, and you hear Kenny's I, side of the story. I believe you. Kenny, okay. like, Thanks. Jane's side was like, oh, Kenny's crazy and everything. Kenny's side is like, you know, um, Jane's crazy, and he was just doing it to protect Clementine and the baby. So, I guess Kenny's side oh, of the story makes more sense than Jane's side. Between us in this place. Even though she lied about it, which is fucking stupid, and hid the baby. So kind of mad at, but still, Kenny Kenny's side of the story makes more sense. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Now we're heading up north, probably Wellington or yeah, of course Wellington. Maybe we can find that camp everybody's been talking about. Nine days later, so nine days to reach Howes and nine days to reach wherever we are. Smoke? That's definitely gotta be the camp. I wonder how big it is. Should we start the rest? I'm gonna hold them. We're almost there, Kenny. It's just a little further. We're almost there. I sure hope that's a cook fire. Cook fire. Oh, we could use a hot meal right about now. <laughs> Might be all I need. Come on. I'll race you to the top. Oh, you got this. Okay. Hey. He cheated. Hey, I didn't get to run yet. Oh, it didn't. No QTE. Okay, I wanted to push A to run and beat him. Come on, Alvy. We got this. Okay, this is not fair. You cheated, Kenny. Got a head start. You cheated. Oh my God. Thing's huge. Holy shit. That thing is clean. definitely walker proof. That's gotta be it. I... <laughs> wow. I can't believe we found it. It's about time. You were telling me. That's a big wall. That's a big camp. What are we waiting for? That's bigger than Come I expected. On. This one's gonna be the one. In the open Look area too. Walls. Finally feel safe. That's definitely. Be able to sleep at night. It just feels too good to be one. Oh my god, it scared me. That's far enough. Military much? Just stay still, Clem. Do as she says. It's a military base. Put your hands up, Clem. Okay. Drop your weapon. Do I have... Wait, I probably have a pistol. That we used. Uh, yeah, pistol. Nothing else. Approach the gate. We're gonna leave a perfectly good gun. Okay, I Just ain't gonna complain. Just a couple of people at the front gate. They don't look like trouble. Who is you? And is Krista in there? Tell me Sounds she's good. in there. Hi, I'm Edith. You're Edith? Name's okay. Kenny. And this year's Clementine. Hello. Oh, she had oh, a big nose. Oh, a handsome boy. Look at him. What's yeah. his name? So let us in. Alvin. Junior. Is Krista here? Yes. Is there someone named Krista in there? I don't think so, dear. Oh my god, where is she? So, she this is Wellington, right? A lot of people call it that. Okay, so what do we do to get in? Well, 
This should be free. Come I'm on, man. I'm afraid this is the part where I give you the bad news. What bad news? No, they'll turn us down. We got some baby and you're giving us a bag. The hell's this? That's some supplies. Food, water, well, some that's medicine, nice, first aid. Why are but you we want to things? get in. <laughs> Unfortunately, our community isn't accepting new members. We're over capacity as over it is. Over capacity? Not enough to serious? go around if we keep bringing people in. It's just three people. We're not a whole Things group. Are you kidding me? I'm sorry. I really am. You're not sorry. So we're supposed to just take this and go? But, but we have a baby. You can't just let this, us do this. This is hard for me, too. I don't want to turn anyone away, especially children. Well, you don't have to but forget the capacity. Just take the kids. What? Kenny, Please. no. Wait, wait, Kenny. Just take the kids. It's too dangerous can, out here for them. We can somehow Kenny, squeeze them. Just a little girl and a baby boy. You can make room for that. You can take back the supplies you gave us if that helps. Please, just... I need them to be safe. And it's safe, safe, safe in there. I know that. Just ask someone, please. This is too nice. They won't make it out here. This is way too nice. Oh. And she, he's guilt tripping I'll him. Ask. Like, take the kids. Just give me a leave second. me. That's nice. He just wants to want Clem and the baby to be safe. You don't need to look at me like that. You're leaving us. If they'll only take you two, then that's how it's got to be. Kenny. We don't even know these people. It doesn't matter. It's safe here. You two will be safe. That's what's important now. He just cares about us. That's that's nice. Oh my god. That's that's nice, really. We can take the children, but oh, I can just take the Kenny. children. I made the case that Thank you. Just Thank you. One more man. Listen. Why can't he okay? take Kenny? Listen. This is your chance. Over compassion, you my ass. This boy. I don't trust myself to keep you too safe. Not anymore. I am more. Please. I'm begging you, please stay here. Stay here where it's safe. Where you two will have a chance. No, no, no. Why are you are serious? Doing like, this? I can't because allow one way. more man in here. Think about Alvy here. Please, Clem. Just do as I'm asking. And this one it'd be great last for time. It'd be great for Clem and people. I'll be doing make it. friends. People better than me. Good people. Mm -hmm. they, they don't have to look at you. Why can't they let them in? Feel ashamed at what they put you through. I'm pretty sure they got plenty of food. Just making fucking excuses. We want to sleep with a gun next to you every night. You can be a kid for a while. It's what he wants. It's what Kenny wants. It's what he wants. He wants okay. the baby and Clint okay, to be we'll safe. Stay. Good. We'll stay. Oh my God. Oh my god, this is oh the right god. decision. Okay. Right. When he's grown, you tell him about his mommy and his dad Alvin, and all the people who tried to keep it's him. Rebecca, safe. Nick, you tell him, Carlos. Okay? He deserves Pete. to know. Everyone. Uh, I got to Everyone kill them safe. Oh, here. Here. Take this. The hat. <laughs> Not the hat. When he when he's old enough, you make him wear it. He'll It'll keep the sun out of his eyes. <laughs> That's important. Um, All right. Good. I probably I should have chose this ending. Please. <laughs> like really. Now, you take care of Alvin here. You, you live a good life, okay? This ending is way better than Jane's Don't ending. Like this. for real. Okay. Oh my God. Now, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Or one of us. Or one of us changes their mind. Oh my god. You're gonna go now, by yourself. I'm gonna walk away. And I might not look back. Not because I don't want to. I had to have too many I'm real people. Glad to have met you, Clementine. Can I get one last hug? Just one more hug. No, wait. <laughs> No 
now I feel like a complete asshole for killing him in my original playthrough. It's when this end. It was a. It was a. It was a like more impactful ending. This was the true ending. Why that you? Why that shoot Kenny? Why let's talk to that shoot Kenny? This made this this ending was way better than Jane's ending. You got a fucking fort instead of hoes, how hardware shop, whatever. Oh my god, I was so wrong. I was so wrong. This ending was way better. It's would it made for a more sad ending. Oh my god, like oh my god, Jane's ending was more of like happy yay we got a whole place but this one like this one was like you're leaving Kenny's leaving and you're entering Wellington where you're safe and everything and 21 21.1 no 21.3% of people did that you know went into Wellington with AJ so you know definitely you got her right you got her right you got her right that was definitely a better ending I was like I was doubting you guys I was like how can you top, you know, being back at Ho's house, Ho's hardware shop? It is definitely topped it. I didn't think they would actually make it to Wellington, you know. Got that huge fort, those giant walls and everything. I didn't think that they can actually, you know, top that. You know, the giant walls, man. That's in, that's, that's, that was definitely a better ending. I'm, so, um, thank you guys for telling me to actually go ahead and try out Kenny's ending. It was definitely way better than Jane's ending to be honest. It was definitely way better than Jane's ending. It was more sad. That would have made for a more impactful ending. Other than Jane's. Jane's felt like, oh, everything's all good. And then it didn't feel like The Walking Dead. You know, Walking Dead is supposed to be, you know, I guess sad. And this one was definitely a true Walking Dead ending. And Jane's were more like a, oh, we're back at this place. We can start a community and we can let the people in. So... I gotta say this ending was definitely better. Thank you guys for telling me to try it out. Um, shout out to that guy over on Twitter. I think it's like Nick Fearless, something like that. He told me to go check it out, and thank you for telling me to go check it out. I might go ahead and do the shoot Kenny, oh no, no, kill, have Kenny kill Jane and shoot Kenny one to see what happens with Clementine alone. Not really sure if it's different. Should probably go to Howl's or go to. Wellington, I don't know which one she'll go to, so if the ending is the same, tell me down below and I won't do it, but if it is different, then I'll go ahead and do it, so thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all the support on this channel, thank you guys for telling me to go ahead and play Kenny's ending, it was definitely way better than Jane's ending, ending I gotta say, and I, I gotta say I made, I made a very, very wrong choice, I shouldn't have shot Kenny, I like Jane and all, but you know, after hearing Kenny's side of the story where he was like just angry about Jane supposedly killing AJ, it was more understandable. But, you know, Jane's side of the story was, you know, oh, he is crazy. Uh, this is what he really is. He's like both of their stories just somehow bounce around and it's basically up to you to pick which one you want, which is the pizza and ice cream. Do you want, you know, do you want um to go with the person who Jane says is basically evil or mean and stuff like that or you want to go to the person that's basically a nutcase as Kenny described so that's pretty much it thank you guys for watching and I'm out